game night. Date night. Tonight on game night, date night, Nikki and me, Lincoln, are going to teach and show you how to play New York Zoo, a game for one to five players designed by Uwe Rosenberg and published by Foyerland and Capstone Games. Don't worry, there actually are meerkats in this game. Welcome to game night, date night. Tonight, we're going to play New York Zoo. Lincoln, why don't you give us a little overview? Sure. We are zoo owners, competing zoo owners in New York, and we are hoping to build the best zoo in New York. I didn't even know New York had enough room for all these zoos. Exactly. But we are going to be collecting these polyomino tiles uh, that are enclosures or puzzle pieces to put in our building space here to help grow our zoo and then collect animals at the different locations on the board and breed our animals. Yes. So it's a race to fill the construction area and the first player to do that will win the game. Uh, there are some tie options too. We could potentially win together. Who knows? We'll see. <laughs> Why don't no. you tell us about how we play? Okay. We are playing with the um, two-player board and the way you know this is there's a little in the corner, a little icon with people. So we got two people boards going. Lincoln has flipped it over to the four player. You can see you've got kind of a park going on there in a four player. I'm sure player. that's just because the space, the tiles <laughs> run out. Uh, you get a little bit more tiles yes. uh, available to you as a two player in a two player game. Okay. Um, the other thing the board shows you is up in this corner here is the barn area. And the barn area has three houses on them. Now, these are these green things. Um, each one holds one animal, kind of in reserve, sure. until you move them onto your green enclosures that you're going to build. Cool. The other thing the player board shows is um, the turn order. So I am going to be player two. Oh, and I see I'm number one. Okay. Lincoln, yeah, you'll be number one. And when you set up the action strip, you're going to separate the four different shades of green and place them into the slots as shown on the action strip. You're going to start with two animals at the beginning of the game, and these are shown on the top of, of the column here on each of our boards. So Lincoln is going to start with a flamingo and a meerkat. Merely a cat. And you will take those and, yes, put them into the houses. I get a meerkat and a tree kangaroo. Tree kangaroo. Tree I see a lot more than kangaroo. tree. kangaroo. So there you go. Looks like a bunch of them in there. <laughs> Um, the other animals available are penguins and the white arctic fox. Cool. Okay. The center here is the action strip and you will be moving around the action strip gaining animals, gaining enclosure tiles, and when you pass over, possible breeding, which is gaining another animal for your zoo. Okay. What do we do on our turn? On your turn. You're going to move this elephant from this starting location here with the red dot. You can move him up to one to four spaces, and that also varies on player number. When you move, you can go to any space on the board. Spaces are the blue animal acquisition spots or a slot that still has enclosure tiles. As soon as all the enclosure tiles are gone from a space, you can no longer stop there and it doesn't count as one of your movement on the board. Exactly. And a breeding area is not considered a space. You just pass it? You pass over it. Okay. So if you were moving four, one, two, three, four, you would stop here. Collect your tile and then breed animals? You would collect your tile. You always do your main, the main action first and then the next Secondary action is if you have passed a breeding location, you then would do the breeding. Okay. When I land here, I would take the topmost enclosure and place it anywhere on your board. You are not required to have them next to each other. You are allowed to rotate them flip and them, yeah. flip them, right. whatever works for you and what you're trying to accomplish. So I will put mine here like this. When you take an enclosure from a slot, make sure to place the question mark. That is, in case it does not fit on your board, you can place it back. Okay. Tiles cannot 
be placed on top of each other or overlapping each other in any way. Or overhanging, Or right? overhanging, yeah. yeah, the ends of the board. For example, this is illegal. It is hanging off the edge of that tile. This would also be illegal if I have it off. Right, must fully fit in it, your construction area? Yes, exactly. If you cannot legally place an enclosure on your board, you cannot stop at, at that, that location. Slot? Okay. Yeah. So you would have to move. I did the full movement of four, so I would have to move somewhere else. Maybe that tile will fit me. Maybe I go all the way back to get the animals. To, to get the animals. In the animal acquisition space? Yes. And that is the same with the animal acquisition. If you cannot fit those animals in an enclosure, then you can't stop in that space. And that's different from taking an animal if there are no more animals left in the pool, you are not bound by the bits. Use some, the rules actually say, use something else, improvise. You can put okay. whatever onto that. I can't that. imagine we'll ever use all those, I but you never know. Maybe you have a whole <laughs> bunch of tree kangaroos there. I can't imagine. A lot imagine. more than three kangaroos. I can't imagine either. Okay. Uh, these extra animals here are also used kind of to change out if you want uh, to. To so, track what you yeah, have. Yeah, if you've got three in an enclosure, you can take the wood oh, bits okay. out and replace it with those tiles. I'll get to the attractions a little later, but also the single area attractions, which I think are mainly just the food stands, right. um, are not limited either. Oh, okay. The larger ones, however, are limited. Okay. So when you are placing an enclosure, you have to put an animal on it immediately. No enclosure can be empty. So I would take one of the two that I have in my homes, in my farm area, barn area, and place it on one of the squares within that enclosure. Now this enclosure is only going to be for the meerkats. You cannot mix different animals in a single enclosure. Oh, okay. If you cannot place an animal in an enclosure you have acquired, again, you cannot move the elephant to that action and do that. You have to choose a different place to place the elephant. If I had another enclosure and I had animals on it, I could also take an animal from an enclosure and add it to this new enclosure. However, when you do that, you have to make sure that you have animals left in that enclosure. Again, adhering to the rule of no empty enclosures. The exception to that rule is when you finish an enclosure, you will score it. That means it's full of animals. You take all of those animals back. You can place one, if you have the space, back into a house in your barn area. And then the rest of them go back into the supply. Okay. And by scoring, we mean you get to take a attraction and place it anywhere on your board. Since this big one's there, I'm going to take the right, big right. one. Right, right. And remember, winning and ending the game is filling up your construction area. Then we come to animal acquisition. For this example, I'm going to put this enclosure on my board. This space allows me to take a tree kangaroo and a meerkat. I will place this tree kangaroo right here. And then I can additionally, if I have that animal type in my barn area in a home, I can take one out and place it in the same enclosure. I can also get a meerkat. Awesome, there you go. And place it into the enclosure as well. I could have chosen to put it into one of my empty houses. The reason why this is important is if I had landed on this animal acquisition space, I would take the meerkat, of course, there you go. because I've got the enclosure for him. But I do not have a space for the flamingo. So I could still take the flamingo and put it into an empty house. If I don't like either of these animals, you can always take an animal of your choice. When you pass one of the five animal breeding lines, you are going to do the main action first, which is acquiring the animals in this case. Then you will do the breeding. Breeding works like this. You look at what the animal type is. In this case, it's going to be a meerkat. I have a meerkat enclosure already on my player board. I have more than one meerkat, so breeding can happen. There you go. Right. I get a meerkat. 
and it must go into the enclosure where the breeding happened. It cannot go into the barn area. And remember, the breeding of this species happens for all players. Okay. I can breed up to two enclosures when breeding a species. Oh, cool. An additional part of this action is if I had another mirror oh, cat. Okay, here's one. Okay. Um, and this enclosure bread, which I already added to, I could take one from my house and put it into that enclosure as well. If I had a second enclosure of meerkats, that bread, I and, you and still had I, one into the house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it's like really populating like bunny rabbits. Cool. In a two and three player game, there's also a bonus breeding action. You get to choose another enclosure of any species to breed. So, so in yeah, my you get, case... Yeah, you're going to get another... Uh, that's right. Tree kangaroo. Now Fill you got up. tree tree kangaroos. I, ha ha ha. I'll keep going on with that one. I know you will. <laughs> For this example, could you hand me two more meerkats? Sure. <laughs> and I will act like they were already here. And now this enclosure is full. After... A breeding action or any action where you add more animals to an enclosure, you always check to see if that enclosure is full. You will then score them immediately. I would take all of these meerkats off. You may place one into a house if you have the space for it, and then the rest of them go back into the supply. Okay. This is the only time an enclosure can be empty. Then I can choose again from the attractions. Right now, I am just going to take well, one square Yeah, you one. certainly would take a bigger one, right? Uh, you would, because yeah. there's less of them. And place it right here, where I'm never going to be able to place a tile. Yeah. It's possible you may score more than one enclosure at a time. Cool. When the game ends on a main action, which is a player filling their board, that player is then the winner. When the game ends on a breeding action, it may be that more than one player fills their board. Okay. How do you break the ties? <laughs> the player with the most animals on their board wins. If there's a tie, the tied players win. Cool. Let's get to it. Okay. Okay, I'll take the animals and put Oops. them back. You get one of each of those. Yep. No flamingo. Uh, dark green and yep. green. All right, and you have number one on your board, so you... Okay, we start over here. Well, I guess I'll go here. Take that and put it right there. Okay. Put an animal in there, because yes. I got an animal to put in there. You oh, must. Hooray, I'm winning the game. All right. Uh, that's a tricky one to start out with. I'm going to move two, so one, two, and take this one. Uh, flip it. I didn't put my question mark there. I didn't either. I don't think Although you're going to have problems yeah, I don't think exactly. at the beginning of the <laughs> game, but there. there we go. And I will make this a meerkat enclosure. And that is that. Okay, so we do have, we do have uh, breeding, but neither of us are in a position to breed. Nope. I'm going to take this one, put it here. Nice. And then put my meerkat in that enclosure. Meerkats. Oh, I just knocked my flamingos down. Or flamingo. I need more than one. You need more than one. We all need more than one animal type. Okay. Um, do I want animals yet? I mean, it is a kangaroo, a tree kangaroo and a meerkat. I could get another meerkat right away. Yep. I will do that. So I will take the meerkat and put it in the house. And could I get a... Yep. Meerkat. Tree kangaroo in the house. Tree kangaroo in the house. Yep. And I will place a meerkat in my enclosure. Awesome. I get to do... I'm acquiring animals. So I'm going to get one... Oops. One meerkat and one flamingo. I'm going to put them so they don't miss that there's an actual spot there. Okay, the, the meerkats should be facing each other. Not that you can see that from above necessarily. Jeez, you know what? I don't think I want to pass that because you will get to breed two species and I still only have one. All right, let's get another enclosure going for my tree kangaroos. 
Okay. Well, I can't stop here because I have no more animals. Right. So I must go to animal acquisition. Animal acquisition. Uh, first thing I can do is I can take a flamingo. A flamingo. A flamingo. And I can take a tree kangaroo yes. and put it in one of my empty houses. There's That's a kangaroo right. house. Tree kangaroo house. Sure. We also passed the breeding. Yep. So every enclosure that has at least one animal, two, two. animals in it, we can breed. Well, I yes. can breed the uh, meerkats. Plus I get to breed an additional flamingo as the bonus for sure. a two and three player breeding action. You also get to breed. Yes, uh, just meerkats though, because I do not have two tree. Oh. Well, you have it only set up that you have one animal there, but you could have put this animal on there at yeah. the time that you did that. So you can then breed both of them. So okay. you get the you get the meerkat breeding plus you get the bonus action of a, a tree kangaroo. Okay, so there's that. There you go. Cool. Now it's your turn. I gotta get animals, so I will go here. And I get a Arctic fox. Mm-hmm. And a meerkat, so my arctic fox will go in one of the houses. houses yep. and I will put another meerkat in its enclosure. I will go. Hmm. I guess big ones are good if you can do it, and I can since I have a, yeah. a, a, a species to be able to do it here. Hmm. Oh, I didn't put my thingy there, which I should. <laughs> Although it's kind of there. I don't know why you would have any confusion of that, but... Maybe we should just leave it on the last place we picked a tile up from. Maybe. I don't know. I'm confused. I'm already confused by that, so I don't know. There we go. That's not so bad. All right. Now I get to put my tree kangaroos. I only got one of yeah. tree kangaroos. And look what you passed. I did. Flamingos. Flamingo breeding time. Yeah. Hey, look at this. Bonus you breeding. And your flamingos. Yeah. So tree I will kangaroo. Put, I'll put a tree kangaroo since I want to make sure there's two in there too. So now I have two of tree kangaroos. Two of tree. Two of tree. I think I'm just going to move one and get some more animals there. Sure. So a flamingo and a penguin. Penguins. And that'll fill up. They're practically chickens. That fills up that area now. Done. Well, I'm going to go to the next spot here. Oh, I don't have it. I'm going to go to this spot. Yeah. I'm going to get a, I'm going to get a tree kangaroo and a arctic fox. What does he say, by the way? I don't know if they make the same noises as regular foxes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, now I have the animals, so let's get the enclosures. Do I want that enclosure? I don't know. I do. It should fit, though. I, would it, I got a square right there. It's going to fit beautifully you can flip right it and go here. The other way. Uh, oh, no, no. no, you can't. I'm sorry. So I missed the little, the extra the little, little square extra underneath square. your hand. Uh, but fingers. look at that. Look at that. Look That's at that. Pretty great. And then, oh. Which one you get to I, choose? What's coming up? Okay, I've got enough of those guys. What's coming up? Penguin. Let's put a penguin because we're going to pass chickens. a penguin there. I just need to get more penguins because one lonely penguin won't do it. That's correct. I'm going to go one, two. That doesn't count. Oh, yeah, that's right. One, two, three. Now I'll put that there just in case this doesn't fit. I think it will, but I'm trying I think to... so. Oh, hey, that's awesome. Oh, Wait. that's perfect. Yeah. Arctic fox time. Ek, 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 ek. That's right. Okay. okay. Your turn, Nick. Mm. I will just move one. I will take an uh, Arctic fox, and this Arctic fox will go in here. And I will take a penguin, and he will go directly into the penguin enclosure. Awesome. Now I'm prepared for breeding. Correct. I'm in trouble because I don't have penguins. Um, what did I want? 
That one looks pretty good. I'm gonna go to this spot. Does this fit? It sure does. Oh, I can't do it yet. I need oh, animals. I need animals. Yeah. I need animals, Nikki. That P. was that's happened to me. I'm going here. Okay. And I'm going to take a flaming or actually an Arctic fox or a flaming, I guess, both at the same time. Hey, my Arctic foxes are ready to breed. These flamingos are getting dense here. There are. Is that full? It, no, there's one more spot. Really? Yeah, you can't see it. He's right here. Oh, okay. I, I'll do it like this. So you I can see, see it. Here. There we okay. go. There's an empty space. <laughs> okay. Uh, and breeding. So I'm going to take a penguin. Whoops. And then for my bonus breeding, I will take a meerkat, please. Yeah, they're both three and three before they're full. So now this is two and three. Okay, so you got Arctic foxes and flamingos. Well, I will go, I'll go here, because I need aminals, and I will get a penguin, who is practically a chicken, and a kangaroo, a tree kangaroo. I have four kangaroos, I've broken my tree kangaroo streak here. Okay, I'll put it over here. Nikki P, your turn. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get an enclosure for my, I guess, my foxes. Question mark, question mark. Mm, that's almost going to be a spot we don't go to anymore. Uh-huh. Ooh, that works. Right in there. And I will place the Arctic fox. Cool. Well, you make sure you should put that second Arctic fox in there because it's going to breed right now. Oh, yeah, true. Okay. I'm going to move one, two, three, four. Mm. And what that does, it gives me an meerkat and a flamingo. And guess what? You're full. So first thing I do is I take all of these off. Yes. It's the flamingos are going crazy. I'm going to put one there. Sure. A little spare. Flamingo, rest in the the pool, and then we get to breed Arctic foxes. Okay. So I'm going to breed an Arctic fox, and I will take an additional kangaroo, I guess, tree kangaroo. Okay. Bonus breeding. I'm going to take an additional meerkat, please. Meerkat. So now, I filled that out. I get to take mm -hmm. one of these attractions. I'm going for the Buku one here. Of course. Um, maybe just put it over here. It fits perfectly. Nice. It's a roller coaster. It's a crazy roller coaster with a loop, no less. <laughs> this is not just a zoo. It's, in a, it's the Animal Kingdom in Disney World. <laughs> okay. We're supposed to be in New York, though. Yes. Well, New York could have a Disney World. Sure, in sure. It. Someday, maybe. Okay. What do I want? Pieces. Where do you want them? On your board. I don't know. I think I'm just going to take this... Uh, skinny tile? Skinny tile here. And... Be the flamingo strip. Does that work that way? Yep. Yes, and it will be the flamingo strip. Ta-da! Tudor. I will go. I want. I got spaces for animals here, so I will take that one. Maybe put the question mark there. May not actually fit, or may not like its fit. I may not like its fit. Hmm. Harumph, I say. That's, That's a not perfect. So bad. That's nice. So I'll put the. I'll start anew with penguins. Wait, what do we got coming up? Penguins are well, you, way over gonna there. We're going to breed right now. Yeah, I'm just looking at other breeding things. I'm putting the flamingos, flamingos out there in the hopes that I can get another one out there. Okay. And now we get to breed. So I'm going to breed the uh, a meerkat, and I think you get to do the same thing. Yes, I do. Okay. Coming up. It's pretty close. Okay. So then I clean these guys off. I'm going to save one for sure. Yep. Here you go. And I get... Oh, you want one of these little ones right here? 
Exactly, that's what I want, Lincoln. <laughs> and we'll take the next biggest one. Yep. Oops. You sure you don't want one of the little ones? I'm pretty sure. Uh, okay. Pretty sure. I thought you might be leaving that for no. me. Okay, it's now your turn. Okay. I'm going to take some more animals. So, a tree kangaroo, and I will put that right there. And another flamingo. Flamingo, okay. And that... Oh, that really, oh there we go. Looked like... Oh, yeah, it's the, the meerkats don't look like that. Ta-da. Ta-da. Okay. Okie dokie. Hmm. See, what I really need here is this one, right? Mm -hmm. So it goes, oh, it can't go off the edge of the board. Boo. Oh, just get yeah, the chop, scissors, chop, chop that little chop part right off. off. Um, if I go to the meerkats, I can get meerkat and fox. I might as well just do that. Meerkat and fox. What did the fox say, Nicky P? Er, 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 er. Okay. Such an old reference now. It is pretty old. Okay, your turn. I'm wondering if that is a bad piece to take or just take it. Take it, take it, take it. Just take it. I don't think it's bad. I mean, I would like well, to take that one, but I saw those animals. I'm like, I kind of need them. For my board, it's kind of funky. Funky, funky, funky. I'm out there. I kind of am in the same spot as you are, not really, sort of. Okay. I will go to the flamingo... Penguin spot. Penguins. Okay. Take a penguin and a flamingo. Put the flamingo in the enclosure and the penguin up here with his pal in his own penguin house. That's right. And breed Breeding. your flamingos. Yep. Hey, and a bonus breed of, hey, meerkat, done. Meerkat, done. <laughs> and I have a flamingo thing going on. What are you bonusing? And I bonusy. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, A. Arctic fox is closer okay. to being full. They fit much better if you put them in an exact line there, the flamingos anyway. Sure. Ta-da. Okay, well this one's done. Woo. So I will take, I'll keep one meerkat, put the rest in the supply. And I will take, obviously, I guess the next big one, although there's other Well, this there. is four also. It's just a strip instead of a sure. square. Yeah, that's pretty good. What I'll do is I'll put it right here where it's kind of a, a bad spot in case something wonderful comes up. Uh -huh. There's there are some here, like that one would be great coming around the corner. There you go. Then a whole bunch of stands get... on the edge of the, t <laughs> edge of the uh, um, are they all stands? Yeah, these are all food. Oh, no, but the, the other ones are rides, I see, okay. Yeah, the these ones that we big did. ones are rides, and then these are like food court kind of. Yeah. Food stands, okay. Now it's your turn. Now it's my turn. Oh, I forgot, I needed to put my meerkat on this uh, enclosure, because you can't have an yep. empty one. It is now your turn. All right. So that also means that I cannot right. go there, which is what I was thinking of. So I will... Go to kangaroo and a fox. Kangaroo and a fox. And I'm still not full, so that's okay. Done. I think I will go. Hmm. These are not really tiles I want, no. but but I think I'll 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 take it. Meerkat. Penguin. Not on the penguin jet. I need to get them on the board. So I'll go here, take this one, put it. Mm, do I want that one? Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Um, what does it do if I go here? It would work. Into the woodwork. Okay, I'll take that and I'll be penguin it up. Take one for it, to fill it, and then one extra one there. And now it's your turn. Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh, I can't take one anyways. I don't have animals, so we are, are going to the penguin and is meerkat. that a meerkat? Meerkat, yep. So meerkat, penguin, Penguins. and we have a tree kangaroo breeding. Yep, I've got one, and you do too. Yep. 
And I can bonus it, right? What's coming up? Arctic Fox is coming up. So, hey, Arctic no. Fox, you're my buddy. Well, it's kind of crazy because my bonus, I'm just going to take an Arctic Fox right now. And I have two enclosures that are finished. There you go. That's cool. So, my tree... I believe, yeah, my tree kangaroo, so I will put one there and then the rest will go back. Into the, into into the supply. The supply and then my arctic foxes. We'll take your bonus. Okay. Oh, this one will fit perfect. Right there. And then my arctic foxes. Mm-hmm. And we'll put another one here. Eric. And another bonus. I'm almost, oh, should I take a tour and put it right there? Yeah, I would get that out of the way. I mean, although there's yeah, there's I chances yeah. for some good ones there. I'm wondering. I don't think there's anything you really need yet. No, because even this little. Yeah, it could be could, some, like right here. This one could go there. Almost in this case, it's kind of not cool that I have to yeah, you take don't, you another don't, one. Yeah, maybe so just take the two and just do it. it. Although, who knows? It could mean, I don't know. Pick what you want. I know, I don't know. The little L would be okay right there around that corner if you uh, want. True. Whoops. Yeah, that's not so bad. Rear. Okay. Done. I'm going to go one, two, three to this mm -hmm. slot and take this one right here. Yeah, that's a perfect fit. And I'll put my meerkat, my spare meerkat in there. Hey, buddy. There you go. Hey, buddy. Look at this. I got to get, I got to get something filled in to fill that up. I'm just going to go to here. There's a question mark. Oh, yeah, I didn't do that. Place it right here. Place an Arctic fox on it. And then we have a breeding of penguins. You know, they're practically chicken sneaky pee. Hey, you know what? I was all worked up about doing the Arctic fox thing, but guess what? What? Arctic foxes are done. Oh, do I want to do that? Yeah, I want to do that. And then, oh, I'll do my bonus. You got a bonus too. I, I just did it. Oh, that uh, was Arctic Fox. a flamingo, please. Flamingo. And hey, that finishes it. So I put it there. I think you go first since this was your turn, correct? Yeah. So, yeah, you go first. You pick yours, then I pick mine because okay. I, I, uh, I got my Arctic Foxes full too. Okay. Oh. One flamingo. And I will take, that would go there and leave a stupid hole. That's not a stupid hole. I'll take this three and put it over here. Because you never can have enough food around your rides. Okay. And then I'm going to take these off here. on the side into my houses, Arctic Fox house, and I'm going to pick for a, uh, hmm, should I just get the one little slot? I might as well. I don't know though. Well, there's going to be plenty of those. Let me get something bigger. I'll just take one of these as well, do the same kind of thing, fill it up. Oh yeah. It needs, there See? needs to be some food stands near that That's roller coaster because right. they need to puke when they do it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Next turn is me, is me. And I don't know what I want to do. I kind of want more flamingos and foxes. Hey, wait. Oh, no, I cleared that one off. <laughs> wait, I have an empty tile. I know, right? Yeah. You got to keep that I mean, you straight might, you, in you your head. You might need to go back to do that, though, because to fill up your board <clears throat> when you can't place any more tiles. Exactly. So um, I do have a fox. I could take that tile, which is a pretty good one, maybe. Hmm. I think I want to go one, two, three. Okay. Get a penguin. Get a kangaroo. Nice. And then what that does is it clears that off. And I'll put one over here and the rest into the supply. Okay. And that's full. So what do I want? Stuff. I do want stuff. Hmm. Goodness gracious. I 
cannot forget that I have that there. I'll take this three here. Okay. Or maybe one of the corner threes. That's not so bad either. What else is ahead of us? I think I'll take a corner three. Corner Let three. Let me double check. Is there something that would be good that's coming if I do this? I don't this? know. Eh, there's good things all over the place. Um, the, supposedly, the, the way these stack, it, they get smaller as they go down. Sure, sure. You have more things to right. You're, you're going to need it that way, too. Um, I think I want this one here. This is pretty good, too, because then I can just put that in like that. Mm. Lots of food stands there. Ready? Yep, and now it's your turn. Yay, I am super excited about this move. Piece. You get it? Boom! And it fits exactly nice. right there. Nice. I was waiting for it. Waiting for you to finish to be. Ah. You want that one badly. Yes, and then I'll put a flamingo. A pink flamingo. Okay, well, I will go. One, two, three. I think I want that big one, even though we've kept avoiding it. I would yeah. have liked it a lot sooner. Um, I'll go there. Okay. And put in kangaroo, maybe. Okay. Yeah. Or Arctic fox. I don't know. Ah, kangaroo. What the heck? All right. Tree kangaroo. He's only one. And now it's it's Arctic fox breeding, and oh, I can't. Oh, you know. Yeah, I couldn't either. do it either. So that's fine. Okay. Neither of us got to breed Arctic, no. and I was all planning for it earlier. I know. Sad. Okay, I will take some animals. A meerkat and a flamingo, please. And I will add a flamingo here and a meerkat here. Ta-da. Ta-da. Hmm. I don't get to breed my meerkats. My merely cats. Oh, it'll come around again. And you have opportunity to get some more. There's a lot of them. Or is it because it's white and so I'm, it's standing out from the I'm board? I'm sure. One, two, three, four. Okay. Go here like that. Be my Arctic foxes. Okay. Did, we, did you just pass that? Yep, we get to do that. I don't, but you do. Meerkat. Because I only have one in lonely, yeah, yep. lonely fox, but now the fox will not be lonely. Ugh, fell out. He so fell out. He was so excited to be in his... Trying to break free. There. Yep. And then some more animals. I'll take another arctic fox and a meerkat. Please. You got it. Thank you. So I will go one, two, three, get another penguin, penguins, I mean, excuse me, flamingo and a penguin. And a penguin. And a penguin. Penguin. And I get to breed, yes. we both get to breed yes. penguins. So I will breed. Not penguins, I flamingos. I mean, flamingos, I get excited here. <laughs> they both start with a P. No, they don't. <laughs> um, and the flamingo for you. Thank we you, also sir. get the bonus breed, but guess what? That means I have two completed enclosures, which is very exciting. I that need is it. exciting for you. I will bonus breed with a meerkat and complete that enclosure first, but you do yours yep. before I do. Okay, so I first do. one, I'll do the penguins. They're practically chickens. And I will take... Hmm. Take another elbow. And then these guys, wow, I've really got like lots of empty enclosures here. And I will choose this one here. Okay. Oops, I just knocked out the singles. Now I'm gonna slow down here because I got nothing. Nothing. Yeah, there you go. Here's some meerkats and I take Mm -hmm. I'm trying to decide between a singleton or a two. Single two? I'll take a two. 
Okay, it's your turn. Okay, I have animals, so I could get another enclosure. Let's do that. Doot. That is not an easy one to place. I mean, you can place actually. it. I, can I place it that way? Nope. Okay. Doesn't need to fit on the little grid. I, ugh, it's like chopping the board in half. I'm not a fan. But I think that's the best spot. All right, and let's get some more tree kangaroos going on. Okay. Well, I have animals as well. But I will go here, get a uh, kangaroo, tree kangaroo, and a fox. Definitely want to be in chance to potentially breed. Okay, Nikki P. Yes, sir. Your turn. Okay. I do have one more animal. So I could. Oof, that's tear it plus sign. Yeek. You don't have to take it. I don't. I think I'm going to skip to that one. You're going to get to breed. I will not because I don't have another no, no, no. tree kangaroo. Oh, it's tree kangaroos. If yeah, I so hop, keep if I the meerkats, move yeah. to here. Yeah. I mean, but that plus is terrible. So I will let it happen that way. Okay. There you go. Thank you, sir. This way, I think. Ta-da. Nice. Okay. And you get to breed. I do. I will take a tree kangaroo. Now I have tree, tree kangaroos. Tree, tree. Tree, tree. Oh, and I get the bonus for that. Yeah. So I will meerkat it up in case we get to breeding those guys again anytime soon. But they're on the other side of the board. But there we go. Okay. Now I'm going to go... Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm going to animal it up. Get another penguin. And another meerkat. Merely cat. I'm merely a cat. There you go. Your turn. Okay. I don't have animals, so I can't take a space. So I will go get a, Penguins and a fox. And a penguin. Oh, no. That does not fill that enclosure yet. There's one little spot. I'll put it here so it's obvious. Cool. I'm going to take this one here. And I'll put it right here. And I'll fill it with penguins. Penguins. Yeah. Again, I have to skip over up the piece and go to here and get a... Yeah, but I think you're going to fill up your penguins this turn. Fox, here. I will with the breeding. And a penguin? flamingo. Oh yeah, flamingo. And so Why that finishes penguins? also. Nice. But no, for... it's not done. It isn't. Nope. Oh, to there's one little. Yeah. Okay, yeah. let me put it here because. Yep. I couldn't see that. Okay, and then breeding of penguins, penguins. Yeah, for everybody. Yep. Penguin party. Penguin party. P E N G. I'm going to put an Arctic penguin fox party. in. What's happening? Let these foxes fall off too easily. They get excited. For my bonus, I will do a flamingo. Flamingo, and that, and that does th finish the flamingo. Yep, so. yep. There you go. All right, I'll just clean it off. Put one here. Put all those back. Mm -hmm. Grab a two. Place it there, and. My penguins are done too. There. And I'll take Manhattan. There. Done. Cool. Well, I'll go here and get this enclosure and put my flamingo in there. We haven't done any of the moving animals from one I enclosure to another. Because I've been cleaning them out pretty I know. right away. Okay, more animals. 
Okay, so I get a penguin and a tree kangaroo. Tree kangaroo. And I can place in Yeah, an enclosure. Yeah. Previously, previously emptied enclosures. So I will put both of these here. And now that I place this guy in here, I can move mm -hmm. a penguin from think so. a house into that enclosure. I would think so. Yes. Okay. Hmm. The, and this is no longer a space. That so is correct. don't count that. Right. So one, two. I'm gonna tree kangaroo. And we breeded, we bred, <laughs> breeded. We can breaded. <laughs> we can breaded and the so Arctic I foxes. Will breed an Arctic fox. Yeah. Put that in there. Me too. And I will add a penguin as my bonus breeding action. Mm. I like seeing their little white bellies. I know. I what? Well, no, I got that one pouring towards you, but I did. Um, for my uh, bonus, I will take a meerkat. meerkat okay. And I filled up my Arctic foxes. So. Cool. Put one back here. And I will take a one. A one. A one. We're Two ice cream. I got a lot of ice cream going on over here yep. on this end of the board. Okay. Okie dokie. And what do I want to do? Can I get, can that fit? Okay, well, this is where definitely the question mark comes into play. I'm not sure I can get that to fit. Oh, I think you can right there over, if you flip it. This way? Or No, no. Well, that too. There's actually some good places for it. That's a good spot right there. Um, if you flip it this way, this way. Okay. That's a pretty great spot too. Yeah. I'll do it that way. Okay, and I will put a meerkat out again. Yep. Or not, that's not a meerkat. Arctic fox. It's an Arctic fox. Okay. But you know what? Breeding for flamingos will be coming up sooner than Arctic foxes. So let's get a flamingo out there yep. instead. Well, I'm going to flamingo and meerkat it up. And meerkat. Okay, Nikki P. All right. I still have any animals, so does that help? Okay, go right here. That is going to become an empty spot, and this L is going to go right here. Cool. I will go to Flamingo. Flamingo Paradise. Flamingo c Kangaroos. <laughs> Flamingo Roos. Ah, slotting that in there. A little tough. And then here, the flamingo. And we breed the... Meerkats. Meerkats, so... Dig on Nikki P. Thank you, sir. And I'm going to breed a bonus penguin, because they're practically chickens. So, I filled up two enclosures. Cool. First thing I'll do is the meerkats. Hold one over here, case, which I'm going to need. And then I will put in... Hmm. Maybe I just do the small ones since they're going to be for sures. For sures. I'll do that one. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a sec. What? Let me think. Are you There's thinking plenty the aesthetics? Of them I should... Well, no, no. I don't I, I'm want thinking, popcorn there. I'm thinking. <laughs> no, no, no. It's nothing like that. It's. I'm just thinking about like fitting things in. So I think I will... I think that'll be okay. So I'm gonna, I'll take this one right here and put it right here. And then with this one, did I keep a, I, I kept a meerkat, right? That's yeah. what I did, yeah. I'm gonna probably, probably keep a penguin as well, just in case. Sure. Might as well, you always might as well, so you have them. And then I will take, hmm, I'll take one of the small ones then. Do that one right there. 
It's looking out to get soda. it soda. So yeah, drink, drink stop. Okay, Nikki P, your turn. Mm, I cannot fit that W. The W. W. Well, you got to get animals anyway. Oh, I do. Boo, because this would be the perfect fit right there. Right, right. And no. No for you. One, two. Arctic fox and a meerkat. Merely a cat. There you go. Thank you. Well, I will take that spot. Yes, you will. Like yes, you it. will. Let's put that there. And I'll put my merely. Oh, what do you got coming up here? Merely a cat. You are going to have some breeding happening with the flamingos. Yep. Okay. Here I go. Can I fit that one? I can't. So I will go all You don't all have the way. animals still. That's true. I don't have animals anyways. So I get a penguin and a flamingo. Pen flingo. So they can both go on the board. Fan and tail stick. Ta-da. And now we breed. Right. So the I'll flamingos. flamingos. I'll do my flamingo and bonus breeding. One flamingo. And some more bonus breeding. Let's see. I that's will. three away from being done. That's two away from being done. So I will do a fox. Right. Bonus breeding. I will add a kangaroo. Kangaroo. Did you bonus breed? Yes, I took the, that's when I took the Arctic fox. Okay. Well, I'm going to go to the ne next spot here. Okay. And that will be um, a kangaroo, tree kangaroo, and an arctic fox, which completes both of those. Oh, nice. So these will be done. First one here, I'll put a tree kangaroo aside. Ooh, he fell out of the supply. And then um, I'll take one of the small ones. Yeah. And then the Arctic foxes are done. I'll put one in the supply. Might need it. Now Probably don't. Oh, that's nice. But I'll do this. You're so close. Wow. I'm stuck with the stupid plus, plus again. again. Is that T? I can fit the T. Cool. I don't have animals. I cannot. Do the tea because I don't have animals. Oh, but that's great. That is a great one. I know. It's perfect. <laughs> but I don't have animals. So we will go all the way to animals here. And um, that is a penguin and a meerkat. Yeah, and you get to breed a kangaroo. And I would get to breed a kangaroo. I need a meerkat still. And a bonus breed. We'll finish my arctic foxes off. Cool. There. And um, that's very sad. Oops. So an upside down soda stand. That disturbs me. I will put it to the correct direction. There we go. I don't know that I worry about that. <laughs> well, this one's upside down. I know I didn't worry about it. Okay. I definitely need this piece. One, two, three to this <laughs> slot. You're done, aren't you? Well, I mean, it's not done. Oh, it is full, you isn't are. it? You are. It's yeah. full. You're done. Yeah. Boom. Mr. Winner, chicken dinner. Okay. Cool. Yeah, you could should have gone. You couldn't go ahead of it, could you? You no. couldn't have gone past it and made me suffer. Uh, no, because our top movement was four, so right. I couldn't get that far. Well, there you go. What yeah. do you think? I like it. It's, I mean, it's, a, it's a little more, of course, it's a tally game. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's a little more finicky with the animals and how they um, breed. And you do have to pay attention to your enclosures because there's no way of marking like this is an old enclosure. It's okay that it doesn't have an animal in it. Right. Um, well, once you get used to it, yeah. I mean, you, if, you're, if you're playing it correctly, you are putting them on, although you did forget to put the one on that one. I end. did at the b beginning of the game, but um, yeah. Uh, still, I did like it. I've what got a lot of stuff on I this side did. of I, the well, park. Well, look at here, too. <laughs> I, I crammed it all in here as well. Yeah. Just to, like, optimize. I was hoping 
I mean, I'm glad I got that space. I, I knew, I'm like, oh, Nikki's going to probably want that one too. Um, yeah. But I'm very glad I got it. And I don't know with, um, because it's a two player game, we didn't do a lot of, I'm going to move this penguin over to this other penguin enclosure. We didn't do a lot of that kind of movement. Well, one of the cool things is that you could potentially fill a smaller enclosure more so, right? If you yeah. took, like you had a large one and you had one guy sitting in it, you could move it into, when you claim a smaller enclosure, you can move one over in there as well and, and help. Uh, as fill long it up as sooner. that. Well, you have to have at least two in the enclosure right, that you you're can't moving empty it, from. Exactly. It, it can't be empty, right. but yeah. Well, like if I had done this, right? That's only four that I need. And if I had one, I could move it in there and then I'd only need three and it'd be closer to being done. Yeah. And I mean, these are helpful on the top of the board to see oh, what, uh, of course. what you're doing. You know, you know what, your, uh, ability, what you can do on those turns and you need to just make sure that mm -hmm. you do them accurately. And we have to talk about the pieces because they're all carved out like the animals. They're not, you're not pushing cubes around. They're actually little shapes, which is also very cool. Yeah. You actually kind of had a rough time there because you had, for near the end there, when you really needed to be filling spaces, you had I no didn't have animals. animals. I know. That was bummed me out because this would have fit perfectly right here. And then, like I filled it after I had passed it, but... That would have been great. Right, you were close. Is that other yeah. piece there, that other shape? It's a tetris -y style shape. I don't there. know if I, I think I feel like I placed one like that earlier. I did. Yeah, there's, no, no that's that has an it. extra spot. Maybe I have it. Maybe. I'm pretty sure that would be on it's here. It's gotta be. Oh, I'm not it, there it is. There it is. <laughs> and that, so that would yeah. fit up right there. But someone would have had to take that yeah. huge, that's kind of a large one yeah, for how far down you are. It's a terrible, are. well, no, it's only number two, right? It's just, it was skipped. Yeah. Whatever was on there was was more important, and it just, by the time we probably got in the game where we didn't really have space for that piece yeah. any longer. Um, I really love it. I love the challenge. I mean, it is, a, it's a puzzle game. It is. And trying to make sure that you get the right pieces to go where you need them to go, uh, it's pretty slick. Right. And mm. this setup for the action strip is interesting um it does show you how you organize uh, organize it because the pieces have four different grades of green and then you would pl you place them in that order and some places don't get the lightest green or the darkest green so it's not completely even and the sizes change as you um, change in the shade of the green you would have actually, if you were able to tie me, you have so many more animals on the board. I only have uh, six, seven, eight. You've got more than that, just, uh, you're not too far ahead of that. You got 10. Uh, no, 12. You got one, 12. One, two, three, four. I took all these off to show them. Oh, yeah, them. you got even more. You got <laughs> 17. I had a fox here and another flamingo. Flamingo. Yeah, it's really cute. The art's very nice. I, it's funny, this is another game with an amusement park kind of theme that yeah. has similar stand kind of things going on. We played um, uh, Me Meeple, Meeple Land. Meeple Land. And something else had amusement park amusement stuff Amusement park too. stands, yeah. Yeah, it's cool. Maybe it's people are dreaming about being able to go to amusement I know. parks it's again. Uh, thematically, <laughs> I mean, this was, I saw this game at um, Nuremberg Spielverlag in January, wow. and that was before the uh, the isolation. So they were they were just thinking ahead that we'd want to live through their board games to do some <laughs> of these exciting things because uh, we um, definitely have been thinking about. It. We're not even crazy for amusement we parks, aren't. but we've been thinking about. It's to go kind to of that thing like now you can't have it, yeah, so you, you want, want it. it exactly. <laughs> your teenage, uh, your childhood era. Yes, there. can't have it. I want it. I want it. We should talk about at least that there's the solo elements here sure. since you can play from one to five players. Yep. Try to blow out that candle. I'm not. Ha. Or catch your hair on fire. Yes, yeah, so catch it. Well, the hair's shorter. Wink. Uh, so here is a solo player. Is it a specific? Oh, it's a specific board, board too. Yeah, okay. it's, it has the one guy on it. And these tiles are range markers, and they are how you are going to move the elephant around the action strip. So, um, if you have... Does it change throughout the game? It does change throughout the game. So, this is the elephant will stay where it's at. And then this oh, is... Oh, I see. This is why this yeah. is telling you this here. And then you have to move two, you have to move three, you have to move one. And then the four is you have to move at least four, but you wow. can move more. 
Okay. So it's interesting that there's right, a zero right. there. So you're going to select from these what you want to do to move. And the zero is neat because you get to stay in the same position and take that action again. But once you're done, you flip this one. And then you have to use up all of them before you can flip, flip them, them back, off, over, and back over, face okay, up, and choose. Cool, that's awesome. Then there is a variant for two-player, which is called the short variant, so it's a quick start. You'd lay out your tiles on the um, action strip, and then you would take the top one off, and, right, then, and then... you had seven other ones that you put aside and put them in? Yes, right. and then you... F so you start with enclosures on your board. Well, thanks for teaching us, Nikki P. You're welcome, Lincoln, and you taught too. That's true, and thanks to you for watching. If you like this video, please click the thumbs up button and consider subscribing to our channel. If you click on the bell, you'll get notified when we put up new videos. We'll see you the next time. Bye.